How's it going? It's your mate Benny Mac. Back in the Scar Model Garage. Oh, I hope you're having a good week, fellas. Uh, last day off for Benny Mac, so I thought I'd better jump on here and say good day to my YouTube modeling buddies and my Facebook modeling buddies, of course. Uh, yeah, just pondering today, fellas, chilling out in the garage, listening to some tunes and looking over some of these foos kits that I've built and that I've still got to build. And I really like these foos kits, hey, fellas, they go together nice, they're nicely detailed, you get some good options with them, so... But yeah, I'm just sort of trying to get motivated for the next build. I don't know what it is lately, fellas, I just completely lost my mojo, don't want to work on anything, can't seem to finish anything. <laughs> But um, hopefully it'll come back around, fellas. And like I said, I've ordered a few bits and pieces on eBay lately. And I've got a couple of goodies here that's come in in the last couple of weeks. So I'll show you them and uh, we'll have a quick look at these Foos kits. I'm not going to do a kit review or anything, fellas. I'll just do a little chat about them and what I've been pondering. So, all right, fellas, let's chuck the camera on the bench. Let's check it out. Alrighty, so first up on the bench, my friends, uh, what came in the mail in the last two, three weeks. I think it's been about three weeks since I did a video. Sorry, fellas, just been uh, too busy on holidays, Easter holidays, taking the little girl to theme parks and having some fun. So, But first up, package from Adrian over on uh, Facebook Aussie Custom Modelers page. He actually sells these Dizzy kits, uh, five Dizzies for five bucks a pop. So... Saved me a bit of time wiring up my own and thought I'd give them a crack. They look pretty good, well made, so cheers, mate. And he also, um, I got a, another detailing kit that he sells as well. Um, comes with sort of all the wires for wiring up your engine and your fuel lines and your brake lines and there's some braided hose in there and all sorts of stuff. So, And these little ones are just some shrink wrap that he uses. He actually did a tutorial on how he wires these dizzies up, and um, I reckon they look pretty cool. So, cheers, bro. Another shout out for Aussie Custom Modelers Facebook page. Really having fun sharing my builds and um, talking with you guys. So, keep up the good work, fellas. Uh, next purchase was an eBay purchase. It is a Arius Pro Mod Supercharged Engine Kit, resin kit. Um, I think I paid about 20 bucks for this. It must have been uh, one of those late night purchases on the couch where you're not really sure what you're doing. But uh, anyway, looks pretty cool. Haven't really built resin before, so I'll have to look into what sort of glue I can use to glue these together. But uh, I'll find a build to put that in. And then um, I got these off eBay as well, my friends. Uh, my buddy Nelson over at um, BSG Customs. Cheers, brother, for the tip. Uh, he brought some of these a while ago for applying bare metal foil and they probably come in handy do some detail painting as well so they're just like q-tips fellas but from mr hobby and tamir and they're really hard and fine and got a nice point on them as you can see and they haven't got all the fuzzy bits that the normal cotton tips have got so i'm really looking forward to using them on some bare metal foil and two shop card shout outs for the week first up is the morris custom model shop James Morrison, cheers bro, got your card the other week. Nice looking card, I got a spot up on the wall left for you. And the Lazy Eyed Modeler, the Woody Workshop. Awesome card bro, really loving some of these designs Paul Turley's coming up with, so keep up the good work there brother. And uh, cheers again fellas for all the shop cards, really appreciate it. The uh, wall's getting pretty full, so. Alright, moving along to the Foos kits that I've been... I was just pondering about them, fellas, checking out what's in the box, uh, wondering if what your guys' opinion is on the Foos kits, have you built them, have you got any in the stash? I see they just um, released a new, I can't even remember what the model is, but the Ford pickup truck that Foos designed, I think it's actually his truck from memory, I'm not 100% sure, fellas, but man, that looks like a cool kit, I might have to get hold of one of them when they come out, I reckon. But the two first kits I have left in the stash, my friends, that I haven't built yet is the 67 Dodge Charger, 426 Hemi. Um, really like how these bodies were moulded by Ravel. I'm pretty sure these are all new tooling. Um, there's hardly any cleanup and they go together really well. There's lots of good options and extras. And then the other one I have is the 67 Dodge Coronet. Uh, once again, looks pretty good. Comes with some cool decals and some good wheel options. 
Um, looking forward to putting that one together as well. Um, have any of you guys built these before? I did do a YouTube search on this bad boy the other day and seen a few of you guys have done it and looks like it comes out pretty sweet so I'm thinking I might do this one next. And for the two that I have done, my friends, the 68 Pontiac Firebird and the 64 Chevy Impala. Yeah, I really like these kits, guys. really like the builds. They came out really nice. Um, did a bit of detail work on the engines and wired them up. And uh, The Impala actually comes with the hood and the boot. The boot does open. Hasn't been open for a while, but there we go. So I thought that was a pretty cool option because of myself, I've never cut doors, hoods, trunks open. I still haven't sort of, I can't get to, for the money I spend for my kids, guys, I don't want to cut them up and stuff them up unless I know it's going to be a you know, good little custom build like the the V-Rat that I can't finish. But, but that's about it, guys. Just sort of do a quick chat on this lazy, rainy, miserable day here in Queensland. Been nothing but rain and cold all week, so... But I thought I'd just do a quick chat, say good day, try and get some inspiration. I'm really liking these Foos kits. Uh, I'd like to get your feedback on them, fellas. But that's about it, my friends. It's your mate Benny Mac. Saying thanks for watching as usual. And you have yourself a good day, eh? All night, wherever you're from. Catch you in the next video, mate. Drop cards. Thank you, fellas. Have a good week.